Hey love bugs, it's Roz. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm going blessed and highly favored and sure I hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. And for my extended family, thank you so much for the love and support and all the kind words that you send me. I'm just so grateful for the new ones that's coming in and I'm so grateful for the ones that's been with me on this journey. You are so grateful. Appreciate it. And for that being said, much love to you. Namaste. Love and blessings. Love and light. And many blessings are yet to come to you. And if you've been watching my videos that have not already, please like and subscribe so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line too. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even giving me the positive feedback. Or just giving me your opinion about the content of my video is all greatly appreciated. And if you enjoy what you heard, spread the word. Give me a thumbs up, like it, and share. It'll be greatly appreciated also. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. And today I'm talk uh listening to us, I'm talking to. Listening to get rid of negative energy, clear all subconscious blockages. Amen. Y'all know we definitely need that because you know, dealing with all the stuff we gotta deal with. We got some blockages up there. We really do. But no, my video today is about Twin Flame 101. When you feel like an impasse, is, this is for all impasse and Twin Flames. Any any impasse you got when we're on this energy roller coaster. It just feels like energy roller coaster. I wonder if y'all feel this way. Because it's like going through all this. You know, you're going through your situations, you're letting go of things, you're healing, and you're trying to, you know, spread the word, you know, spread awareness, and, you know, especially with your being an empath, you're always going out your way to help somebody, and it feels like right now I'm on an emotional roller coaster. It really do. Like, I mean, like, what we already go through mo emotional roller coasters as it is as individuals. But with all this stuff going on, it seems like it is like hitting hard, really hitting hard. And I'm just like, you know, I try to do as much research as I can. You know, my friends be coming up to me, Rosalind, I don't know what's going on with me. You know, I've been crying, I've been upset, I've been aggravated. And it's just like, I'm more aggravated than I usually be. I'm more offish than I usually be. We're going to be going through all type of stuff right now, man. And I'm just wondering if anybody else would like to go on a roller coaster right now with all this different energy coming at you left and right. And you're just like, you know, and it's scary and confusing when you don't really know what's going on with you. It really is. It really is. And it, it's just like, it can be frustrating at times. And you're just like, why am I going through these things? This feels like it's so unfamiliar. Or, you know, why am I feeling this way? Or, you know, I'm just crying at a drop of a hat. It, it's just like, it seems like the more, the more that's going on, it just seems like our empath abilities is just like heightened. It's really heightened, like, with me, I'm flamboyant and, um, medium, whatever you want to call that, but it's just like, it's, like, if you've been on this journey with me for a while, you'll know that, um, I only had, like, a medium situation where I had to let, you know, people know about their family that had passed on, it was like when I first got to the South, so for me to have to go through this again, it was a great experience, you know, and it, it just brings a lot of uh, emotions right along with it because it's not my emotions, but, you know, when you're seeing family get in touch with other family, and it's not my family, but they're talking through me, wanting me to know. I mean, it gives me emotion. It really does. And it's just like, you know, knowing that there's somebody that's out there that really wants to meet their family. They got all these questions for their family. And, you know, even though their spirits are connected to them, there's sometimes you don't be able to do things like that. You know, if you're upset or you're stressed out or you worry about them a lot, you're, you're going to miss out on the things when they're trying to contact you. So it's just like, it was a really good feeling to actually go through that, but it's just like, why? This is a really intense because when I was talking, you know, it didn't, to me, it felt like, you know, is this real? You know, um, am I lying? And, and then it's just like, well, when I talk to my friend, 
it was like she was like, oh. <laughs> you know, you you know, there is you have to be, you know, they have to be there with you, you know. So it's just like going through all these things. My dreams are have intensified. It's just like things when I really don't remember my dreams, and it's just like I'm not the type of person that I go off. With you know, like, oh gosh, what is going on with my dream or whatever like that, but even though you should pay attention, it's just my level on my brain when I'm in that sleep realm, it's like way out there to where, to the point where I don't even remember having my dreams like going through the day, I might get bits and pieces of it, but it's like those emotions are still there and it's just like, you could be okay during the day and next thing you know, bam you pop with somebody else's attitude you might get aggravated or ticked off and you're just like wait a minute you know well I was just fine or you know I was just happy this minute or I was just calm this minute and next thing you know this comes in and you're just like okay mother earth okay Gaia what what's going on what is there things that I need to learn is there things that I need to know like you know I had my friends come to me and tell me you know I keep hearing a couple of rain in my, in my head or I, I keep on seeing it I've been myself going on YouTube and probably seen about 30 times either with my dad's video or other people just doing covers like for right and I'm just like what's going on because I can't really watch that movie it just brings up too much you know uh, emotion for me because it kind of reminds me of the things that my dad went through before I was born and it was like life imitating art imitating life so it was just like all these emotions are coming up and it's just like am I the only one am I feeling like I'm on an emotional roller coaster because I mean it's a good feeling because I know this gives me something that I can tell you about. These are the things that, you know, there's more people going through this too, you know, but it's just a lot of us are not open enough to tell, you know, especially if you're watching these videos, some people leave comments and other stuff. But it just feels good when I know I'm not the only one going through these things on my own. You know, um, I guess I'm just more vocal with mine. It's just, it's, it's a good feeling when people can drop lines to me and say, you know what, I've been going through this, you know. It just seems like now, I, it's like the energy that I have is like, like spirits will. You know, if spirits come to you, it's like they have to feed off of some kind of energy near them for them to be able to be present with you or, you know, whatever. But it just seems like, with the energy that I've got going around here, it, it's like my, my TV will mess up, you know, my, my internet, it, it'll just be messing up. And I'm just like, God, dog, is it, you know, I get frustrated not thinking about all the energy I'm consuming. It's messing with my electronics. And then it gets me frustrated because I'm trying to figure out what's going on. And I'm just like, wow, you know, am I the only one really going through this? And it's just like when I talk to people around me, it's just like, you know what? I never thought about the stuff that you're talking about until you just told me that. Because it's like, yeah, you know, you blow light bulbs and, you know, you might buy some batteries and you're like, oh, okay, they're probably outdated or whatever. But it's just you draining all that stuff off of it, you know. So, I mean, you know, drop me a line. Let me know I'm not the only one going through this. You know, if you're going through things like this and you feel like you're on an emotional energy roller coaster, you let me know. Because I don't want to be the only one feeling like I'm out here by myself doing this stuff. <laughs> so, don't make me feel like I'm by myself. So, y'all drop me a line. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. I hope you are able to resonate with my video. You know, you're going through things. Just know that we are going through this, but we're going through it for a reason. And I know you're probably getting frustrated and just like, you know, I'm so tired. I'm tired. Yes, we are all tired. But no, this will be straight work at the end. I don't know what God and Gaia and Mother Earth got for us, but they, they really got something for us. For us to be going through all this hell, we're not going through it for a reason. You know, there's supposed to be some good things that's going to come out of this, and I really have a good feeling about that. So, stay blessed, stay prosperous, you know, do as much meditation as you possibly can, clear your energy as you possibly can, spread as much love and good vibes as you can, frequency as you possibly can also. And stay blessed. I will pray for you, and I hope you definitely do the same for me. Drop me a line, like, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell, and I will see you on my next video. Peace.